I know you've supported what, what's called the fair tax, abolishing the IRS, coming up with a new uh, way to, uh, to tax uh, consumption, really, than the income tax. That's a long-term project. Let's talk about if you were president in January 2009, would you, for example, want to uh, keep the Bush tax cuts in place because they expire, as you know, in 2010? They absolutely need to be uh, made permanent, in part to give consumers and investors confidence that they're not going to be uh, looking at an economic downturn because of high taxes. I think everything the government does needs to be in the way of dialing taxes down, not dialing them up. If we want to stimulate the American economy, create more opportunities for small business owners. Right now, a lot of small business people are feeling the crunch of taxation, regulation, and litigation. The result of that is that many simply are not competitive. And it's not because they don't have great ideas and aren't productive. It's because our government has policies that actually tend to work against small business owners. And that's where 80% of our jobs come from. If we don't do something to ease up the burden on small business, then those small businesses can't become big businesses. The economy gets in serious trouble.